You want to know one of the craziest stories I've heard from a Vietnam vet? What's that? There, uh, th this is unrelated, but while we're talking about terrors of war, I think this is interesting. There's a guy I know who used to work at this gun shop I would frequent, uh, and he was he was a riverboat gunner in Vietnam, uh, mm -hmm. and he did he did some deployments to like you know set up ambushes or whatever, um, and he had completely forgot about this story where one time he was uh, waiting on patrol outside of a village. And he was using a little nail that he had found, like just lying in the rubble outside of the village. And he was cleaning the dirt from under his fingernails. Mm -hmm. And he hears a noise and he, he was laying on the ground next to the M60, the big belt fed gun. He was cleaning his fingernails and he hears a noise and he looks up and like five feet from his face, there is a guy standing there holding a rifle, like a, like a, a, a Vietnamese, like a Viet Cong standing there just looking down at him oh god just holding the gun and he says that the man said are you going to shoot me in perfect english and like in reaction he like dropped the nail pulled the gun shot the guy and while telling me the story he said to this day i don't know if he spoke english or if i heard it in my head that is and fucking he, insane he had completely completely forgotten about that story never remembered it got out of the war never bothered him until 40 years later he was helping his son build a barn on his property the fucking and then nail. midway through he picked up a nail and started to pick dirt from under his fingernail and it all came back to him at once it's insane what the human brain can just store away yeah you, just you know completely I mean? like, blocked off ugh. until that moment and he remembered it all like it happened yesterday yeah